What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Uh, High-end football mixer just sold out. One box of 2020 Flawless and five Hip Parade VIP RPA editions with uh, the Flawless in this random team's number one, guys. So again, it's a very high-end mixer. Obviously, some sell sheet hits and potential Flawless hits and potential RPA one of, uh, RPA uh, VIPs. So like the Hurts, the Kenny Pickett, you know, the uh, Josh Allen, the Patrick Mahomes. A lot of really cool stuff potentially coming out of that VIP hit break. So that is basically half a case. <laughs> Five boxes from this one. And of course, you have another Flawless here. Uh, so it'll be half and half, basically. Half cases on both. Now again, we've had a lot of people buying straight up. And a handful of people win from score pack filler number one, two, and three. So congratulations. I'm not sure, Eric, but we'll find out. Usually it's one of those in every case. So probably only one, maybe. Now here's the Cardinals out of the Commanders. All teams in. Here we go. Let's click dice roll. And it is a five and a four nine times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Nine, Allen, down to Jason. Five and a four nine. Nine, <coughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight and nine. <laughs> nine times, nine, nine. Jacksonville Jaguars out of the Miami Dolphins. So again, we got nine, nine, nine. Here we go, guys. So Alan, you have the Jaguars as well as the Titans. Michael with the Chiefs. Nancy with the Texans. Sean Maddock with the Raiders. Tim with the Browns. Adam with the Bills. Harry with the Cardinals. Willem with the 49ers. RJ with the Jets. Sean with the Bengals. Kyle with the Patriots. Willem with the Chargers. Pick. Michael with the Cowboys. Eugene with the Packers. Definitely playing like Zach Wilson. <laughs> uh, Eugene with the Packers. Sorry. Nancy with the Bears. Jason with the Seahawks. Kyle Fox with the Steelers. Willem with the Commanders. Jason with the Bucks. Dennis with the Ravens. Sean with the Lions. Roy with the Broncos. Alan with my Eagles. Uh, Jerry with the Saints, Carlos with the Panthers, Ivan with the Giants, Sean Robinson with the Colts, Allen with the Vikings, uh, Tim with the Falcons, Kyle Fox with the Rams, and then Jason with the Miami Dolphins. Now also to remember, I don't think Nick put up all 10 potential sell sheet hits, because there is 10 cases of this, but I think he only put up a couple because he wanted to make a cool collage. <clears throat> so, just remember that. Oh, see you later, man. See you tomorrow? Yep. All right. Oh, am I am I ahead of you guys again? Adam, sorry. <laughs> Keep my lips shut. That's happened to me the other day. Man, they keep on giving it to Montgomery, bro. Give it to Jamar Gibbs, bro. Man. Yeah, you know what it is here, too, Adam? Because you know what's funny? I have my account on this TV and then the main TV for the guys. I gotta, I gotta be a hero, right? So, whichever one is started first, like if they started that one first before me, I'm even like 10 seconds behind them or vice versa. So for like the Eagles game when I was watching it two weeks ago here, that TV was turned on first, so I was like 15 seconds behind it, so I freaking had to shut the door all the time. This is 
Oh yeah, that's right, remember? That's because you don't be in that who sees the world until it's Alright, well, anybody want to make any trades, guys? I mean, I know, uh, Big Chunk is giants for trade, but I'm not sure. You know what, Adam? I could have drafted him. I've drafted him the last two years. First couple weeks, destroying out the Lions. Then after that, injured. So... I decided not to draft him this year because I didn't know how it was really going to go. I really didn't. I know DeAndre Swift is the most talented. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> but with Kenny Gainwell getting injured week one and coming out with like, like two teams or coming out with you know like a week and a half off, then yeah, DeAndre Swift basically just took it over. That's it. Like took it over. Right? So like now I'm kind of upset because I wish I should have drafted him. But again... I've seen this before. Like, I hope he doesn't get injured and he stays healthy because it's like a career year for him. You know, obviously, maybe potentially payday next year so he can stay healthy because I think the Eagles would pay him if he can somehow stay healthy and produce. But, yeah, like, you know, it's just I've seen it before the last few years, and I think everyone's just waiting for him to just get injured again. They kind of know that this is kind of the way it goes. But with our line, I mean, everyone's going to feast, you know. So that's the thing. But that's how I feel with Jamar Gibbs. I feel like he's so much more better than David Montgomery. But I don't think they. I think they want him to be more healthier probably throughout the long, <laughs> the long haul of the later in the season, because they probably have a lot of big packages and runs for Jamar Gibbs. But they don't want to use him too early in the season. Like we're good with splitting it for now or giving this guy the goal line. But later in the year, I feel like they're gonna unleash him. You know. But yes, with the Eagles though, I mean it's it's pretty sad because they get to the one yard line and it's like Hurts sneak it in, which I'm okay with that because I have Hurts in all of my fantasy leagues. I don't care. I drafted him as my second pick. <laughs> I was not gonna wait not have Hurts this year because I already knew he was gonna get uh, chances of getting touchdowns. But I'll, I'll show you guys a funny video that I found online, which was like a reference to what probably people ask Jalen Hurts about when he scores a touchdown. You know what, guys? Actually, hold on. Let me pause the video really quick so I can see if there's any trades, and I'll come back right now. All right, you guys. Welcome back. No trades. Let's close the trade window and start the break. So I think I'm going to start off with the flawless, guys, because this stuff could be massive because it's only one card. <laughs> I wish they did that. Like, you know how they give half a sack? Like, what happens if they both run it in and, like, you know... Are holding on to the ball together, you know? Would they give it half a touchdown? I mean, they give a half a sack, so. Interesting. <laughs> Alright, well, since we're only gonna use one of these guys, we're gonna have to choose which one we're gonna use here. Now, remember, guys, I, I think this break took a little too long to fill, so might have to not repost it and maybe use the flawless for like a one box picker team. So remember, depending on what hits in the first half, second half could be part of a picker team or potentially a future mixer. Same thing here. So look out potentially for falls. I think we were planning on maybe putting up the next box as a picker team, just one boxer. It'll be a lot cheaper, of course, because this makes it a lot more expensive. But so yeah, think about that too as well, guys. Uh, remember, one, two, three for the top, four, five, six for the bottom, guys. Oh, didn't get off camera. There we go, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. So this one right here will be used for something else potentially, because like I said, it took a little too long and I want to try to at least sell another one soon. So I'm going to go with Flawless first, guys, honestly. Just because I think that stuff could be some bangers over there. We know we're going to get bangers. <laughs> I mean, we could. Probably have to sell a little bit more breaks then. <laughs> but yeah, we can. Or, I mean, I'll twist your words and I'll, and I'll uh, twist your words with like flawless box? Empty? Sure. <laughs> we'll give away a flawless box. Doesn't have to be sealed though, right? <laughs> uh, 
I learned it on the track. All right, guys, here we go. Colts already got a hit right at the top. All right, here we go. First one, guys. Alec Pierce, 22 out of 25. Indianapolis Colts. See you later. Uh, Sean Robinson, there you go, on the board, buddy. We have Aiden Hutchinson, who's having a great game. Lions looking great right now, guys. 11 out of 20. You know, maybe maybe uh, Jordan Love just hasn't faced the Lions defense the first few weeks. Detroit Lions, that's going to Sean Maddock. We have a Zach Thomas, freshly inducted into the Hall of Fame. Well-deserved. This is an all-pro ink, though. 14 out of 15 for the Miami Dolphins. Uh, that's going to Jason Kirsch. And then we got a nice Damian Pierce. Nice flawless RPA, 14 out of 20 for the Houston <laughs> Texans. Going to Nancy. There you go, Nancy on the board. From that pack filler right there. Number three. We got a George Pickens. Nice little uh, ruby. Or no, sorry, probably this is Sapphire. Sapphire, 7 out of 15. 7 out of 15 for the Pittsburgh Steelers. Steelers. That is going to Kyle Fox. And we got for the Green Bay Packers, Christian Watson. Nice. This one's had a lot of rookie RPAs in here. That is a 10 out of 15 for the Green Bay Packers going to Eugene. And last one here is a two out of six flawless grades of Teddy Bruschi. Teddy Bruschi, that is for the Patriots, Kyle Fox. Nice, nice. Nice, this was a great little inner box here, guys. Christian Watson, RPA, George Pickens, Damian Pierce. Very nice. <laughs> now let's go to the big stuff here, guys. Good luck. I'm not sure which way to go, but I think I'll start off over here, guys. Debo Samuel, three out of five. A little emerald for the 49ers, William. <clears throat> well, not yet. Remember, we still also have that other product, so that's kind of the good thing. And we have a Najee Harris, one out of 15. Sapphire. <laughs> wow, two relics here. Maybe we're going to get a monster in the middle, maybe, hopefully. Uh, Steelers going to Kyle Fox. And last one here, champions, Joe Montana for the 49ers, little vet, 11 out of 25, so this was kind of, well, actually the encased stuff was more vet, there you go, 49ers, William, nice, and that one has the champion set right there, which is probably going to sell for a little bit more because it's dedicating all the Super Bowls he has, nice. All right, guys. Well, like I said, so we had a lot of rookies in the mini box, more vets in the encased. So the second half of Flawless, if we put it up as a picker team, could have a lot of potential big rookies. So you never know. So look out for that. That could be posted later tonight for tomorrow, guys. Now let's go with the VIP RPA. Remember, we're not done yet, guys. Not done yet. Five boxes of VIP RPA. Now, again, this one obviously could be anything. Obviously, we have a couple sell sheet hits potentially that we can hit. But, of course, like I said, I mean, all teams are represented in parade products. So, everyone's going to get a shot at this as well. All right. So, we have five boxes on the left, five boxes on the right. Same thing. Let's try to get this going. And it is a six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So, again, these ones would be used for something in the future. Maybe we can just do like a <laughs> random team's break of this or something alone and separate it so it's a little bit cheaper. Well, here we go, guys. One card, five out of a hundred box number. Oh, 
Alright, here we go, guys. Good luck. And it is Justin Fields for the Bears. Three color patch and autograph. I know he's been off to a rough start, guys. Just the Bears in general, but... I don't know. Maybe this could be the week, guys. Someone has to win this week, right? Between the Broncos and Bears. Maybe finally this is the week Justin Fields <laughs> plays really well with the Bears. All right, Bears, though. That's still a hit right there. Uh, Chicago Bears. That is going to Nancy. Next one. 17 out of 100. On that, that specific card too, Adam? <laughs> yeah, that's true. Oh, sideways. Nice, Lamar Jackson. How about that? Baltimore Ravens. <clears throat> Seven out of 75 RPA. Ravens, that is going to Dennis. All right, next box, guys. Oh, this one looks like a graded card. <clears throat> 2019 Select Rookie Signature Memorabilia. How about Daniel Jones for the Giants? Try to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. How about that, Ivan? That is a tie-dye RPA out of select. Now, graded at 8.5, it looks like the edges and corners messed this up, but still, two out of 15. We'll take it. <laughs> On the board. All right, two more to go, guys. Yeah, you can definitely crack it if you want to. I mean, I, select ones are really hard to tough to grade because they're thicker cards too, like the RPAs. Oh, this one didn't have a paper. I don't know if you guys seen it though. But it is a Panini 1 RPA precision of Sauce Gardner for the Jets. RJ with that one. Two color, three color patch and autograph. 12 out of 99. <clears throat> All right. Last but not least, here we go, guys. Hopefully we get a big one. Obviously, there's still five boxes remaining, so potentially you could have a bigger one there, but here we go, guys. Double coverage. How about a Tua Togavailoa? Beautiful patches, too. Seven out of 15, and the Dolphins, guys, again, they're hot right now, man. Miami Dolphins, that is going to Jason. Tua Togo by Loa. Very nice patch right there, too. And the top hats, too. And that is from 2020 Plates and Patches, which is an RPA. Nice. Well, again, guys, obviously, we have five boxes remaining, and I'm not sure which all of them were sell sheet is. Let me see if I can find it out, though, because there could still be other ones that we didn't notice, but... But yeah, it looks like a Mahomes is a sell sheet hit. The Penny Pickett, the Josh Allen, the Herbert. This is Jalen Hurts. Justin, there's a Justin Fields from National Treasures RPA in here. Jamar Chase, Najee, Derek, and Lamar. So yeah, we technically haven't seen one just yet. So it could be hiding in one of those guys. <clears throat> but there you go, guys. Thank you guys so much. Again, obviously, only has two boxes. And obviously, these are, sorry five boxes here but only one card per box and then falls of course you know not that many cards popping out of there only 10 but thank you guys so much guys remember for the guys that purchased today in the filler or a couple straight up spots you have a chance to win back some money but again guys uh, look out for flawless to be posted again but maybe as a single one box break so that way you can get your teams in that one later tonight appreciate it guys jazbeescasebreaks.com